1992, uh, my wife Laura and I moved uh, to mid-Michigan. Uh, we had been tasked with beginning a Young Life ministry uh, here in the Greater Lansing area. And it was an exciting time for us. Uh, doing full-time ministry had been a dream of ours. Uh, we were newly married. Uh, we were new to the area. We had a ton going on, uh, but we didn't know anybody. Uh, we were looking to get connected. Um, uh, finding a church was a big priority for us at the time. Very quickly, we ended up landing uh, at Riverview. Uh, Riverview was meeting in uh, the auditorium at the Kellogg Center at the time. We, we loved the vibe and the energy in the room. We could see that we had a lot in common uh, with uh, the young families that were there. Uh, but more than anything else, uh, we loved the fact that every weekend uh, when we went to Riverview, uh, that Steve opened the Bible and taught straight from the scripture in a way that we felt was extremely faithful uh, to the biblical text and also very applicable uh, to our lives. We got involved with a life group right away uh, with some families that, that had a lot in common with us, young kids, um, similar life stages. And uh, for eight or nine years, we were connected with that group. Uh, and that was an incredible blessing for us. Over the years, um, there wasn't much overlap between Riverview and what we were doing with Young Life. Uh, Steve Summerlot and Paul Denherter were incredibly encouraging and supportive of uh, what we were doing. They loved Young Life and, and we enjoyed our time at Riverview. But when we moved into the new building, a bunch of people um, from here in Mason where we live and where I've been a Young Life leader for a long time started um, getting connected over at Riverview. The leadership team uh, from Riverview approached me and, and, and spoke with me about getting more involved and it's something I had been thinking about for a long time. And uh, so to be able to use my gifts in, in terms of teaching and leadership development and helping people get connected uh, at my church that I've been involved with for so long has been just such a huge blessing for me. My wife and I started a ministry called Rib Buddies, uh, which is, uh, helps families that have kids with special needs uh, to get connected at church and provides a one-on-one -on -one buddy for uh, those kids with special needs. And that's a huge passion of ours and it was a big thrill for us to be able to start that ministry together and to see it flourish and grow over the past several years. It's been uh, amazing for me uh, to be connected with a group of guys and link arms with these men um, as we try to share the gospel uh, with people here across the Lansing area, help people grow in their faith, help people to live sacrificially uh, for Jesus. So I'm excited about what God has done uh, through Riverview uh, for the past 35 years, for the 20 years that I've been involved. And I'm really looking forward to um, seeing the gospel go out into this community for the next 35 years and doing whatever I can uh, to be a part of that effort.